Hello there, if you are watching this video you will probably have a bug that you want me to fix. However a lot of people have basically sent me the same stuff over and over again and uh, telling them over and over again what they should do is not that efficient to me. So that's why I decided to make this video and cover the most prominent examples of these bugs. If after this video you still haven't been able to fix your bug, don't worry, you can still just comment and I will look into it for you. If you want to perform multiple actions with a check, you need to put these actions between brackets, like here. However, these are not the correct brackets. I see a lot of people just use the normal brackets here, but you need these ones. They are not the same and if you use the normal ones, you will just not make this code work. However, there are uses for the normal brackets. For example, after a function, you will need these normal ones. Using the special ones will not work. And there are other occasions where you need them. Just be sure to really pay attention to which brackets I use in a video. Another thing I commonly see is variable misspells. For example, capital letters are really important. Here, check is spelled with uh, a lowercase and here it is an uppercase. This will not work. You need to change it to a lowercase in order for the game to really handle the variable well. Another thing is, yeah, simple misspells. Like, here's double check and here, doable check. This can happen at any time, but just be sure to really spell it right. If you do accidentally use a misspell, you will get an error like this. Here it says unknown variable check. That means that somewhere in your code, you misspelled check. It can either be at the very beginning, it can be at the end, it is just somewhere there. When this happens, just go through all variables check and yeah, see if they are all correctly spelled. If you're using Game Maker Studio, the error will look slightly different. Here, uh, this part, a random number dot check, will indicate that somewhere in your code check is misspelled. So just go through your code and search for the misspell. Another thing I commonly come across is uh, brackets not being closed, which is the case here. If uh, you write a lot of complicated code with a lot of brackets, like here, things can get messy and you may overlook some things. That is fine, uh, but of course it won't work. Here, this red rectangle indicates that something is wrong and that something can be found here. Symbol close bracket expected. Basically, we opened too many brackets compared to how many are closed. So, as uh, it says here, we need to add a close bracket. And if the red rectangle goes away, you know that you've done it right. Sometimes I also see people misspelling resource names. Uh, resources meaning sprites, objects, etc. Now this is very close to the variable misspelling we uh, discussed earlier, except the fix is easier here. Basically a resource should always have a certain color. By default it is gold. And in Game Maker Studio it is uh, orange I believe. But when it doesn't change color, if it's just black, then the resource name is wrong. And you can just mess around with it. You can look the resource, uh, the resource name up and when it changes color, you know it is right. So that's a way to check if your resource name is correct. Built-in variables uh, such as keys or special numbers also change color. Uh, some of these include the global tag before a variable, it should be blue, uh, sprite index, image index, etc. These are basically built in variables and they are also red. Resource name, we, we already talked about those. Uh, floor, seal, or round, those are also red. 
and coordinates x and y, those should also be red. If you use one of these built-in variables and it just stays black, you know you have a misspell. If your bug still exists, even after watching this video, feel free to ask me. However, if you use a variable misspell or anything else covered in this video, I'm afraid I will not answer your request. I just don't have the time to look for every comment and fix everyone's bugs because those just take a lot of time to really fix properly. If you still have a problem that couldn't be fixed with this video, please follow these three steps. Step 1. Describe the problem. Now, if you just give me code and don't really tell me what is happening, then I can't really fix the code. I just need to know what exactly the bug is, uh, what triggers it, and by that I can look into the code and really see what might cause it. Step 2. Send me the error. When you run the game and something is wrong, you will most likely get an error message. And this error message will describe the problem quite accurately. It will tell you what event to look in, uh, it will tell you what code line the problem lies in, and often it will literally tell you what to do. Uh, there won't always be an error message, sometimes maybe the player just clips through the floor, I don't know, and then you don't get an error message, but when there is one, please share it with me because it would make my task a lot easier. Step 3. Send me the code. If you don't send me the code, then I really can't fix it at all. I don't know what you did wrong. Uh, I really can't tell. Uh, by sending the code, I mean only sending the code in that specific event where the error lies. The error message will most likely tell you uh, which event you should look at. But if there is no error message, just try to think of what event probably causes it. And then if it is the wrong one, don't worry, I will just ask you for a different event. But at least share the code that you think uh, really produces this bug. Last of all, if you want to share your bug with me, please do so on the right part in the right tutorial. Don't post it on this video because I have no idea where you went wrong. If you post it on that specific part of that specific tutorial, where it went wrong, uh, it will be a lot easier for me to find out what the cause is. That being said, thanks for watching.